A big promise being made to Columbus students. You can go to college for free. A new program pledging free tuition and a stipend at Columbus State. Investigator Haley Nelson digging deeper into this and talking with some very excited high school seniors. Haley, this is a big move. Yeah, station some excited kids. Some city leaders calling it a historic day. Here's the plan. It's called the Columbus Promise, promising Columbus City School grads starting with the class of 2022 up to six semesters at Columbus State for free. City leaders promising me they've secured funding for the next three classes and are looking to further this and even make it permanent. The people were jumping and screaming for the fact that they knew that they could go to college for free. CCS seniors getting a shock Wednesday morning. Some telling me they almost didn't believe the announcement. Free college is this key to this American dream. City and school leaders detailing the Columbus promise, a plan to make the path to higher education free. Here are the requirements. Graduate from a CCS school, fill out the free application for federal student aid, and apply to Columbus State. That covers up to six semesters at no cost. I'm overwhelmed, you know, but, but overwhelmed with excitement. Superintendent Dr. Talisa Dixon hoping this could help 500 to 700 students starting out. I asked about data shared with us showing fewer CCS kids enrolling in post-secondary education in recent years. Our students know want to um, start early and really give them access to those experiences early on. And we in Columbus City Schools have to do a better job doing that. Students setting Columbus State in their sights. When I heard the news, I was very grateful and excited that I didn't have to worry about how much I need to make to cover my college expenses. I know for me, college search was getting a little bit stressful because it's like, yes, I know I'm going to get in. I know I'm going to get um, be able to see myself on campus, but it's like, how am I going to pay for it? Leaders estimate needing about $9.5 million for phase one, lasting about three years. We want this to be a 50-50 split in terms of public and private uh, support. Can they promise the class of 2023 that they'll have the same opportunity? Certainly, certainly. This is for the next three classes for sure uh, and really it's just the beginning. We believe that this will be successful. The city is responsible for four million dollars. Columbus say a million and I'm told there are around 1.5 million in private dollars right now. So more funding is needed, but city leaders tell me they're confident saying talks are happening now. The hope is that this could also help with hiring issues and boost graduation rates. There's also talk about potentially expanding this to four year schools in the future, maybe even other districts. You can find more information online on your site. I'm Haley Nelson.